Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So for today's video, I thought we'd do something really fun. We're always doing fun stuff, but this is extra fun because I thought today we would do a little outfit, lookbook, a little summer aesthetic clothing lookbook. This video is really just going to be me putting together a bunch of cute fits that I like. I'm really just trying to let my creativity flow and pick out super cute outfits. A lot. How many do I have? One, two, three, four. I have um a lot. I really haven't counted how many outfits I'm going to do and I'm just going to see as I go how many I can create because you know sometimes you can layer stuff different ways and switch up one or two things and it's a whole new outfit just because I used to really be dressing I used to really be into the fashions and somewhere along the way I don't know I definitely still like made an effort to dress but my clothing style choices just became really simple like I didn't try to actually create looks anymore so yeah I'm kind of slowly getting back to that just recreating outfits and looks that I think are cute but yeah I'm really excited to show you guys my aesthetic and just some cute fits some cute fitty fits before we get started be sure to hit the subscribe button down below let's be YouTube friends forever and we're gonna go ahead and get into this video yay So for this outfit, I love skirts like this, like long satin skirts. You can pair them with almost anything and everything. What I try to do is match colors up. So I picked this do-rag up from the beauty supply store. I'm pretty sure it came from Bow Wow's do-rag line. Yes, Bow Wow has a do-rag line, but I really like the hints of gold in it and I feel like it matched up. These are little kitten heels I paired with it also. I just feel like this is like a boho-ish type look. Looks like this are really easy, like I said. Skirts like this, you can match it up with anything. So I just tried to pick a bunch of nude tones to go together. Okay, so my style is definitely minimalist, I feel like. The less is more, less is more, that's the saying. That's the stuff. So for this, I just have these. I think these are boyfriend jeans, if I'm not mistaken, but I could be wrong. I really don't know. But they're those jeans that are really baggy. They have holes in them. And I just feel like wearing baggy jeans with a tight top, a bandu top, it's just a good fit. But yeah, I saw this look on Pinterest. I live on Pinterest. If you ever need a style guide, go to Pinterest. I promise you, you won't be sorry. But yeah, this look was really popular with just baggy jeans and then a tighter top on the top and then some heels at the bottom just to kind of add a little fashion to it. You know, when you have the choice between heels and then you have the choice between tennis shoes, it can make or break an outfit. I would wear this one with either or, but I went with heels. Okay, this is one of my favorite looks because A, it totally reminds me of the 2000s, which is kind of the vibe I was going for, and B, because it involves a bucket hat. And let me tell you, bucket hats have saved my life. Just this recent year, I've realized how important accessories are, and yeah, I've been accessorizing for sure. So this is kind of, I tried to do a like 2000s look with the tank and the big clunky shoes and I just feel like that's what this reminds me of a hundred percent so platform sneakers have been the love of my life honestly I've worn them so much over this past year I think I like them so much because I'm short and I like the fact that it gives me some height but yeah this look I'm definitely feeling and I love the skirt even though it doesn't fit me but none of my skirts fit me Okay, so this is one of my go-to looks and because it is simplistic with the simple black and white, I probably should have, I'm realizing now, silver earrings. That would probably make more sense, but this is one of the most simple outfits that I put together and it's always a go-to is jeans and a plain top and some earrings and period. That's it. That's the look. 
So I also paired these with some pink filas and I love having pink filas because you can really dress these up with whatever you want. They're kind of a, uh, it's like a pop of colors so I can put it on with a sweatshirt or whatever and it kind of looks like my outfit's complete and I really didn't put in that much effort at all. All right, so another bourgeois, bougie outfit. This one is one of my favorites because again, it kind of reminds me of the 2000s again, just because my stomach is out and I feel like people don't, like nowadays it's like high-waisted, covers your belly button, but back in the day it used to be belly buttons out, period. But I really love this look. This one's definitely more chic vibes. I mean, except for my tennis shoes. But I feel like the tennis shoes are what make it me because I don't be wearing heels like that. I'm just not that girl. Like every once in a while, sure, but much more comfortable in tennis shoes. And I feel like it kind of makes the look more streetwear rather than more sophisticated, just so it's not too sophisticated. And here we have another bucket hat. So like I said, bucket hats are my life. I hope they never go out of trend just because accessories. So this one, it's kind of all over the place. I don't even know if these colors really go together like that, but whatever. So in an instance like this, like I have two things matching the hat and then my little tank underneath, they're kind of the same nude color. And then I have the pink on top. I just feel like they're kind of similar colors. Like they're kind of all a bunch of nudes and pinks. So I feel like it flows together. And then I just have some shorts and tennis shoes again are my best friend. I feel like they're just easy for me and I'm definitely trying to transition to some heels, but tennis shoes are my life for right now. Okay, I know I said each one of these was my favorite, but this one is actually one of my favorites. This is giving me boho vibes, and I could be wrong, but I'm probably not. Um, honestly, I love this outfit so much just because, I don't know, I think I like the color tones of it. The brown, the green, and then the pops of red in the purse. The purse really is what's giving me boho vibes, but I feel like I wouldn't wear the outfit without the purse. The purse is what makes the outfit. And then the top is kind of one of those satin tops and it's loose fitting and I don't have to wear a bra with it because my boobs are tiny. So tiny boob girls, we rise. And we back. Okay guys, so that's going to be it for the video today. I hope you guys liked it. I hope you guys enjoyed the fashions. I hope you like the styles, the fashions. If you did, be sure to give this video a thumbs up down below. Hit that subscribe button so we can be YouTube friends. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.